Hi, Mike Schwartz here, Managing Director of iTech Minerals. Uh, it's been a while since I've given you a video update, so I thought it was time to get on and give you a bit more information about our ASX release today, where we have released our latest results from uh, the resource drilling at Macroma Central. Now, I'm very pleased to announce that the, the latest results have allowed us to triple the strike length of our mineralization at Macroma Central. So late last year, uh, we had drilled about the northern 500 metres of strike of that Lacroma central mineralisation. In the last month, we decided to step out with our traverses, make them a bit more wider spaced and test the remaining 1.2 kilometres uh, of strike that hadn't been tested yet. And the results we received earlier this year, we're very pleased to say, has allowed us to triple that strike length. So we've gone from 500 metres of strike to over 1.7 kilometres of strike of graphite mineralisation. Uh, so that is an exceptionally good result for us and hopefully will bode well for the amount of resource tons we can, can calculate at the Chroma Central. So yeah, we're work working towards defining our maiden resource at the Chroma Central uh, and to do that we need to get the, the latest results back from the drilling. We have about 14 more holes that have just been submitted. Um, and they were, were drilled in the first few weeks of this year. So it'll take about another month to get those results back, and then we'll be able to send all of those drill results um, off to uh, an independent geological consultant to calculate that, uh, that maiden graphite resource at the Chroma Central. Now, the other thing that we need to do to be able to calculate that resource is we need to get some quality control information and also some geotechnical information. So what we're doing, we have a diamond rig that's been drilling for about a week now, and we're gonna drill six diamond holes uh, across that Lacroma Central resource. Now, the, the first thing we're gonna do is twin some of the holes with diamond and make sure that the assays from the diamond core uh, match closely with the assays from the RC core. The other thing we need to do is collect uh, density measurements of the of the diamond core. So when you're calculating a tonnage, you need to know the volume, but you also need to know how dense those rocks are. And you need solid sticks or chunks of, of, of rock, which we get from the diamond core, to be able to measure that density. So as we get that diamond core in, we're gonna send that off to the lab and they're gonna do the, the density measurements for us. Uh, one final thing it allows us to do, the, the diamond core, is to work out how much energy is required to be able to break that rock up to extract the graphite out of it. So that's something that's important for the metallurgical uh, test work. Now, we've just been notified by our uh, metallurgical consultants that the metallurgy is well advanced on the Chroma Central. So hopefully over the next uh, month and a bit, we'll be able to report those metallurgy results. But, but what they're telling us is that the the, um, the first two stages of metallurgical test work have been completed. That is the, the rougher uh, kinetic uh, flotation where you drop out the bulk of the, the gain minerals or the minerals that you don't want uh, and you pr produce an intermediate concentrate, that's been done. Uh, and they've only just completed the cleaner flotation. So that's the next stage where you, you clean it up by floating it multiple times and you, you take it from you know, 20, 30% that you did in the first stage up to the, the 94 plus percent which is our, our target for a, a first pass concentrate at, at the Chroma Central. But it's all going well by the sounds of it. So uh, we'll update the market as soon as we get the results from that metallurgical test work as well. And finally, uh, the, the RC rig hasn't stopped um, at the La Chroma area. It has now moved about two kilometers to the north and we are targeting uh, a new AEM anomaly at La Chroma North. Now, the reason we're going up there is we wanna show the next spot we're gonna add more tons to our a resource inventory uh, on the Air Peninsula. So what we've got at La Chroma North is we've got uh, graphite over at least a kilometre of strike in, in drill holes, uh, and we've got about five kilometres of an AEM anomaly um, that we're going to be drill, test, drill testing over the over the coming weeks. Uh, so again, you know, as we get results from from that drilling program, we'll be able to up, update the market as well. So you know, a lot of news flow coming from iTech Minerals over the, the coming weeks and months. So stay tuned uh, as we work towards our maiden graphite resource at the Chroma Central uh, in May this year. Thanks for listening.